Generic greetings and welcome back once again to Supermarket Simulator. Today's beverage is a very nice dark berry soda, very carbonated indeed. So welcome back to the game and in the previous episode we expanded by putting in this other 4x4 area. We had a bit of a reshuffle and we also got some more products. So for example we have these, uh, I think they're just like marshmallow type things. Either way we uh, need to set them prices and we're going to go for 4 99 Yes, so that's pretty good and in this episode I think at bare minimum obviously you need to restock the shelves. I want to move things around before we open up today and then I'd like to if I can get if we go to management here get a restocker one you need a storage shelf a st uh, sorry a storage rack a storage room and then be level 15 with star level 14 so this is where we've got our storage here um, I'm actually going to put those underneath there um, yes you can indeed do that we'll put the uh, <laughs> the stuff on the bottom like so and actually have some sort of semblance of order here and something like that and then we've got the rice up there is it rice uh, spaghetti anyway yes so let's go ahead and restock so what do we need um we've got oh might as well might as well bring this stuff into say uh, hang on let's put the milk up there and get rid of that and then we'll have a rack there okay done so we're going to go from here and start a restock. We need eggs, cheese, and some water. So over to here, market, what I've already got in here. I've actually got some stuff anyway, which is fine. But let's go ahead and we'll add in uh, some eggs, maybe. Eggs. Uh, well, it was cheese. We definitely wanted cheese. And I was thinking double eggs, and I think that'll probably be it. Maybe. Uh, we'll try and get some water, but we'll see if we can actually... Uh, afford that we can I think I'll be the maximum so I'm just gonna get that and then oh look they're already fallen down all right so fine Um, we do want another I think I do want another fridge what I'm probably gonna end up doing is I'm going to get uh, maybe that in the corner there. another double fridge I won't sell the other one there's no point in selling it but I'll get um, another fridge and I'll put it a double fridge here and then I'll basically have this uh, in the double fridge so we'll have twice as much stuff there and then the single fridge is where I'm gonna have like the yogurts and stuff which is one of the new items and this is the uh, crispy chibi I think that says there uh, the new type of cereal that we have which is good um, eggs we are oh, we're completely uh, stocked up on those that's fine we've got some more of this uh, just trying to smash through the window there and oh, uh, let's remove those because that's not where they're supposed to go so this is a obviously new item for sale which is good chocolate which is gonna go on here so this is our um, like sweet section I guess and then we've got well we've got this stuff here which you, we're gonna call home baking I guess which is why I also want to move things around so for example the bread I want to put the bread somewhere else and have the flour together so I'll have one flour two flour then the home baking stuff and then on the top here I'm probably gonna move the sugar onto that one that's that's the plan anyway, but I, didn't, I obviously need the um, the right box for that. So that's all that set. I believe I've set the price, so that's fine. Um, what else do we need? So we've got a tea, we've got that stuff there. So I want to get um, another one of these cereals, a double cereal for a start. Uh, it was, actually it was water, it was I think a pasta. I'll get a bread, I'll get one cereal and another cereal that's oh only that's pretty much what we can that's pretty much what we can afford today let's just open the store up and we'll get this going um yeah we can afford not much else to be honest i would like maybe what have i got uh oh that's fine we do need another pasta so we'll get a pasta and i think that's pretty much it. Let me just purchase those, and that takes it down to three. Hey, look at that. It actually stacks up, um, which is uh, rare. And, yeah, we've got this thing here. I'm just going to obviously set the price on this one. Uh, $5.99 for that one. Just going to double-check the price for the other one, which is also fine. So, welcome to the... Uh, newly restocked store here. Hope you enjoy your purchase experience while you are here. And uh, the bread. Well, I, I want to move the bread to... Where, where's, where shall I move the bread to? To be honest, the bread... I mean, I can just put here. Like, this is like a common thing. Oh, 
You'd probably put bread and pasta together, maybe. I mean, I know it actually makes no difference whatsoever in the game. Um, it's just something I, I like to do. So I'm just going to move the bread. I'm going to move the bread to here. Like I say, this is our, this is going to be our home baking section. So we'll remove those, put them back in, put that in that corner, and then the flour we're going to shift over. So uh, there's some more pasta, which is fine. That can be stored gently over there. There's some bottles of water. Don't know why I've ordered more water. <laughs> we definitely didn't need it. <coughs> Excuse me. So, um, do we have an empty box in order to move things around? Oh, actually, we do. We can put that there. And, oh, that box. Oh, we can't use that box, which is a shame. And, oh, that, that, that is uh, selling quite well, that. We've got bread. We've got eggs. And lots of customers. Oh, look at that. We've got home baking stuff being sold as well. The price is okay, and price is okay. So we need some blue flour. So we're going to go with two of those, and maybe one of the others. What else do we need while we're ordering? Probably one of each of the oils. So one oil, two oil. How we're doing over here. Soda, we have this stuff selling, which is nice to see. Uh, probably a rice. Don't have another rice, do I? Uh, no. So we'll get a, a rice in. If I can find a rice. Rice and a salt. And I'm... Whoa. That's expensive. That's the olive oil. Okay. Fine. Um, I should probably pay bills while we're here. Oh, I already have paid, paid that. Oh well, past me has sorted that out. Uh, apparently the milk was too expensive, so they say. Uh, I think it's reasonable. Right, so that goes in there. How's our pasta? Pasta's fine. I'm gonna go to the market, purchase that. Oh, I was gonna say it stacks up very well, but not so much. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna empty that, empty this, Pop that down and remove that one and that one. Now, as soon as I put this on the shelf, it should have a price, which it has. Excellent. And do I need to shift anything else around? I don't think I do. Um, yeah, the idea being that, I mean, you could you could even say that the salt's like in the home baking section as well, but let's, let's try I'm not going to uh, stress over it too much. I, I might get to sleep at some point tonight. You never know. Uh, so... <laughs> Let's dump that in there, and this is more of this flour, which can go in there. Yep, that's fine, and let's continue to place this stuff on the shelf. So yeah, we've got, like I said, our home baking section. Oh, the guy didn't get his yoghurt. Right, that's uh, one of the problems that we have. Uh, we don't have yoghurt, which is a shame. And I knew that there might be that problem of people coming in saying we don't have it, but I, I need the new fridge for that, and... Well, I don't think I can afford it. I think it's about 250. Ooh, close. Uh, I think it's about 250. So it's not like ridiculously expensive. Um, oh, uh, the juice is going down. Let me go ahead and grab the apple juice. And we'll get the apple juice in. Like so. I will put this back on the shelf. Get some orange juice. Lovely and fresh. Not so much, actually, because it's been stored in a non-temperature-controlled <laughs> room. <laughs> um, oh, actually, I think we've got enough to to pick up that uh, that fridge, fridge B. Oh no! Oh, okay, right. It's I thought it was two hundred and fifty. It's not. It's two hundred for fridge A, and three hundred and seventy-five for the other one. Okay, fine. Um, but we will get that in eventually. I'm just going to turn that light on. And how we're selling over here? We're selling quite well. Uh, bottle of water, restock that. Um, eggs, I think. We can restock those eggs. And some soda as well. Still haven't sold tea. Um, don't know if it's too expensive. Well, well obviously it must be. It's actually worth storing some of the empty boxes. Because then you can 
shift stuff around. We're going to be ordering again anyway, but I'm, so I'm just going to get rid of some of those. Uh, we'll put in one there and one there. And, yeah, the newly stocked home bake aisle is, is going pretty well. Ah, we now have the new freezer. Actually, it's a fridge. There it is. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to move this along. Uh, I'm going to have, oh, I'm going to be moving a lot of stuff along, actually. Let's just put that in that corner. And that in that corner. And that there. And put that there. I might keep that box to move stuff around. And bread. I don't want to put anything on them ones. So I'm just going to put that in there for now, just to move it along. And have that in like so. Just trying to line it up. Doing a miserable job of it. Let me get a bit closer. For finer precision. That'll do. And then we can probably fit in another one another one there as well, so that's pretty good. So the idea is that all of this stuff is going to go in here. All right, so we'll pick up these. Oh, no, that's wrong. Uh, one second. We have the box. So those can go in there. Oh, hang on. I think they might have glitched out. Because I've been, because I was taking the stuff out, I think they might have glitched out. <laughs> um, can we take the milk for this box? We cannot take the milk with that box. Um, we'll put the eggs in. Put them in there. Um, what else were we gonna have? It was oh, milks here anyway, so we can we can definitely shift stuff over. So with this one, we actually had the milk in like that. Put that in there. I'm going to bring the other milk in, actually. Yeah, we have the milk in, like, all of these fridges, which we can still do. It just means we don't have to restock as much. Still have to do things. We still don't have to do things, though. Um, let's just fill this up, and then this up, and then take it out of that, and put it in there. And the cheese... Is going to go there and there. And there we go. So, that is that cleared and moved over. Which means that we can now get yoghurt. And obviously that's our that's our end game goal, to get yoghurt. Um, <laughs> right, let's restock. And we'll have to... We'll go to the next day, I think. What else have we got in storage here? We've got some sodas. I'm going to pick up the soda because I'm... Assuming that we've sold some sodas. Yes, indeed. That's good. Put it back. And refill. Is this going to empty the box? No, it's not. All right. So I think it's home time. Let us end the day because it just makes it lighter. Products not, not found for. Um, apple juice down, flour down, cereal up. So apple juice is going to go to 3.99. Sorry, 2.99. There was one of the flowers. Um, yeah, that's fine. And one of the cereals. Oh, that's really cheap for for that. So let's just go through, and I'm just going to restock the shelves. So uh, I don't know about the. Spaghetti. Oh, yeah, definitely needs a restock. Right, there's one more uh, missing, but that's fine. And I can't remember about the the juices. Well, there's some apple juice to be restocked. 400 and... 406 generic units of currency. So, one chocolate, one marshmallow, I think, is what that is. Let's just go through this list. So... It's one chocolate, one marshmallow. I'm going to go with two sets of yogurt. And then we just go around from here. Bread's fine. We want, by the look of it, um, one pasta and one each of the home baking. One pasta and one each of the home baking. 
we want in... Uh, that flower can get removed. I don't know what can go up there. One each of the oils in peanut butter. So, oil, oil, peanut butter. I think we can get one more item on this. Um, what are the milks as well, I think? But we're probably coming close to spent up. Oh, we already are maxed. There we go. So, Lini Tower of Items has crashed there. Let me just put these on the shelf. Start that back there. I could open up, but I think we'll make sure that these are stocked at least halfway there before we before we open. And I think today, assuming things go well, we might have enough money and indeed enough reputation to potentially get an automatic restocker. I don't know how it's going to work though, but the fun's in finding out. And there's the yogurt. So yogurt's going to go up here. I'm guessing you can stock, they just stack loads of them. Can you stock it? Can you go three high? That's, is that 30 yogurts in that? I think it was. <laughs> okay. And there's that, and there's that. I will open up now. And then more yogurt. Right, we're just going to put this in here. So we're going to have 60 yogurts. <laughs> I think we've got 60 yogurts. Yes, indeed. All right. Uh, I still didn't look at some of the other stuff. Uh, cereal and coffee, by the look of it. We're going to set prices for the yogurt. Uh, 2 49 I'm going to have as our prices for that. And, oh, immediately someone's making a direct line for that yogurt. Oh, it's, it's also it's too expensive. Okay, 2 29 Let's drop the price a little bit. And what did we want? We want some CC sugar. Oh, to be fair, we could put the sugar up there, couldn't we? That's that's like home baking as well. I mean, ideally, peanut butter somewhere else, salt, sugar, and then the, the, the oils. Yeah, I think we'll do that. I do think we're going to do that. That's, that's happening. That is happening. Um, so I'm going to take some of the peanut butter off the shelf. Uh, where could it go? It could go here, couldn't it? To be fair, I actually quite enjoy. I mean, I can't say I've missed being on the on the tills because it's you know it is what it is. Um, just get rid of that. But at the same time, I like that we've moved over for you know for for that, and we're doing. Uh, uh, let's pick this up as well. And move this down to here. I like the idea that we've um, moved over to something different, so we are moving things around and enjoying the process of that. Okay. So there's that. And this display is now full. Mm. Peanut butter's fine. We're running low on coffee, actually, I believe. At least the yogurts are getting sold. And no rice. What about the... Sodas. Oh, we actually haven't got one. We're running low on that soda. So I'm going to order in uh, two of those sodas. And what else do we need to sell? to move? Oh, We need to move things around. I think we can get rid of this box now. One, two, three. Yes. Can I put... No, there's no way I can put that on there. Right. Um, bread. No one's buying bread. Is the price too high? It could be too high. Let's knock the bread down just a just a little bit. And I don't know if we need to bring this in. No, it's just the one. So the rep's going up, which is good to see. I think we need to probably get Salt and sugar. Just so I have a box that I know is the correct size. There's the salt. That add? Yeah. And the sugar. Uh, a coffee, actually, while we're here. Where's the sugar? I cannot see the sugar. There it is, there. 
and we also need one of each cereal as well. So one of the cereals, which has gone up in price, and one of the other ones. I'll just order that in for now, just because I want to get stuff moving, really. That's an interesting <laughs> way to deliver. <laughs> this is a, rac a raccoon brand, I believe, this one. And, oh, good job we got soda, because we are very much running out of it. And this is the coffee. Get the coffee on there. And the salt. So we're going to go salt and sugar. I think. Yeah, salt and sugar. I don't know what else is going to go on... Um, on the bottom bits of this. I don't know. What was in here as well? Uh, flour. Which we need another flour by the look of it. Let's remove those tags. While I'm on, I'm just going to add that flour. It was blue flour. Going to get two of those. And we've got the coffee again. Get stocked up on that coffee. And more beverages. Almost out of that. Uh, water, like that. I'm noticing the cheese was down. So I'll add in two units of cheese. And this is a raccoon, raccoon band of uh, crispy chibi. And it was the sugar, wasn't it? We were going to move. I thought I added one. Hmm. And I can't use that box. Might be able to use this for the sugar. Sadly not. Let's uh, pop the light on. Oh! Actually, while we're here, let's... Uh, Am I... Bills? Oh, I was going to say Bills, yes. I was looking the wrong part for those. The checkouts are full. Yes, they are. Let's get rid of that. And I think this is where the sugar goes in. Nope. Apparently not. I'm going to buy in a sugar. So... One Sisu sugar... I know it's up the top, but there it is. What else are we running low on? Mm, pasta and flour. But I've already got the flour in. So we'll go for pasta. Two units of. Let me just check the shelving back here. Definitely cheese and definitely orange juice. Orange juice we've got next door, though. So there's the orange juice. Like that. Put that over there. The uh, yeet. Come on, yeet. It won't yeet. It, refu it refuses to be yeeted. Right. Um, I think this is the last bit here. Yeah. There, that's it. So let's get in for this then. Uh, apple juice. We need. Oh, let's go. Two apple juice and two of those. Oh, it's already maxed out. And I can't get it anywhere. Right, okay. Next day, then, we'll have to do that. Let's restock some of this. Uh, coffee. Can this hold that? No. Cheese is uh, sold very well. As has some of the stuff in the home baking section. Evident by the fact that we've got really good money. And... I think... Another flower. I think this is for the... No, I definitely can't find the box for that sugar. And all the home baking. Might as well fill that up as well. Not as popular as the other mix, whatever it is. Peanut butter's okay, though. Doesn't match that size. Yeah. And oil. Like I say, we could be micromanaging the thing all day. Aha! Good. Right, CC sugar in here. So I don't know how you feel about that, but that's what we've done. And I believe that will mean we're able to afford a 
uh, automatic restocker. Which means we don't have to do a lot of what we're doing. Uh, salt. And the salt uh, displays full. Okay, and rice. And there we go. So we'll wait until the next day, and we're going to need to reorder. Now I'm hoping that the restocker will pick up from anywhere. But I have a feeling it won't. They won't. I do have a feeling that they will not do that. They'll just go wherever. Um, they'll, go, they'll go in here, I think. Yeah, I think so. I think they'll only go in here. But the fun's in finding out. Just restock in the fridges ourselves. Should probably leave it, actually, and let them... When we hire someone, let them do it. Yes, let's do that. Right, end of day. So, products found too expensive, 12. Nearly a grand we made. Uh, coffee has gone up and cola has gone up. So, coffee... Oh! Yeah, okay, we'll pick that up. And cola... Three forty nine. There we go. All right, over to here, and we will purchase all of that. I was going to say that, and I will call management, pay the bills, hiring, hire a restocker. So there is our restocker, and they're taking it from there, and they're now restocking. This is good. Let's just uh, put some of this stuff in. So this means that now that we have a slightly bigger, slightly bigger offering, we don't have to do all of this ourselves. Now, obviously, they're not as I don't say this in an immodest way. The, the AI is not as quick as us, but at least they're doing something. Like I say, I, I think it can only take from the racks. And if that is the case, then, yep, you bet you bet I'll be buying more racks. I mean, they're doing it. You know, they're on top of it by the look of it. Um, orange juice. Might as well put that there. Apple juice. Put it there. Apple juice. Put it there. And... Might as well put... That in here too. Yes. Water. Just put in there for now. Anything that's... Oh yeah, so they're just standing about now. Anything that we can uh, automatically do, we will. So we do need to purchase something this morning. We want tea. Uh, tea and rice. Not oil. No. Tea, rice. Let's have a look. Right. I think we'll get a... We'll go long term on this one. Two teas. We'll go rice. At least a couple. Yeah. And how are we doing for chocolate and such? Chocolate, we could probably get another one. I'm going to pick up two. And I'm also going to pick up two storage racks. So there's us really without any some any funds at all now. Um, this rack will move along. Let me guess. Can't fit in there. Yeah, brilliant. Thought so. But <laughs> let's get this set up. And this can go in here. And in here. Can, I, can we double stack that? Apparently not. Right. And that rice. No, you can double stack it. I thought you could. I thought there's no reason. You should be able to do it. Now, naturally, I'm stocking this stuff in here. Let's get this open. Um, for the, stealth, the shelf stacker to stack themselves... That's a tongue twister. Um, and there could be, and there should be an order 
to what I'm stacking, and it should match up with that precisely. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes, we should match it up, shouldn't we? Hmm. Okay. So, top shelf. And mid-shelf. That was actually correct. I'm just doing this one. And the salt. That's gonna be a different sh that's gonna be a different shelf as well. Alright, well we'll see how we get on. This guy is cracking on with things. Um T No, I believe it is is it top shelf for the sh chocolate? It is. So top shelf, top shelf. Get rid of those. The rice is on an entirely new storage. So I'm just gonna place I'm just gonna place something in here. And I think is that the last bit? Yeah, that's fine. So we're selling. We're selling again. And we're making money. So what's the next level? What are we aiming for next level? In management, in bills, no bills, licenses. We have another pro couple of product licenses we can get. 12, 12 and 13 is required. So we've got bleach, cleaners, dishwasher, tablets, hand soap, shampoos, etc. We've got uh, different types of cheeses and honeys and tunas and eggs in a four pack. Um, we've got also butter, cereal, chicken, french fries. Oh, I'm guessing we need a freezer for that. So do we make a freezer aisle down here? That's probably what's going to happen, truth be told. But another cashier is probably uh, level 20, I'm guessing. Um, level 20 for the cashier. We can increase the size of the area. All these are just 4 by 4s But you know, we're making money, which is all good. What about, what about the size of storage, actually? Um, management. Storage. We always can increase the size of it. It's probably worth doing. Increasing the size of storage. It's 800 though, so there's no way we can do that today. I'm not seeing things like the coffee's going down. So, I'll have a couple of coffees in there. And... Eggs. Let's go for some eggs. Um, down, down, down. Up, up, up. Can't find it. Quit the game. There it is. Add that one there. Good. And we'll still stock stuff ourselves. There's no reason just to leave it all up to the other person. And... I don't know what we can put on these are the shelves. Yogurt's too expensive apparently. But the fridges this this fridge here uh, that fills itself, I think. Pretty much. Pretty much. But if we get a bit if we would have bigger storage it would probably help out. And then mirror this thing. I don't know. We've got this one oil and nobody's buying this oil. Is it just too expensive? That's actually very reasonable. The checkouts are full. Yes, they are. <laughs> I'm guessing they just... I'm guessing star level goes down. But, yeah. Anyway, um, over here we're going to go do uh, coffee, eggs, uh, milk, and... What else do we really need? Probably some cereal. I'm going to go for some units of cereal. Uh, we'll have, was it, two of those cereals. And sack it. We'll get the same again in this cereal. And purchase. That's going to obviously drop right down. So ideally we'd want a shelf to sell this stuff. Um... So I didn't want a shelf to um, to store it, so these guys can uh, restock, and it's a mirror image, but we can't at this stage. But I'm just gonna, I guess, just let's just put stuff down. Um, just get eggs in there, and we'll we'll redo this 
as and when we need to. I wonder if you can... I wonder if you can stack them, like, times four. Those you can't. It feels like those you should be able to. Put, like, one, two, three, four. That's probably the case. But anyway, now we're automatically restocking, guys. Cracking on. Sold some of that, which is good. Put the light on. Guessing we've sold an oil. No, we've not sold another oil. Well, that guy's just staring there. So where's our restocker? Is he coming? Hey, they're coming. Here they are. So they're restocking our shells for us. See that? All the eggs. That's good. Okay, happy. So what else do we need? So this is the thing. Now it's on now we're on the like stock control and such. Um I'm gonna put can I buy a light to put it in there? Surely I can. Um let's go with furniture and spotlight. Let me just buy it now because I wanna put it in. Yes you can. There we go. <laughs> a bit of light for you to work with. Yeah. Definitely increase the size of the storage. But do we need to do we look at another product line? I guess it more products means more variety, more customers overall, but at the same time it's more stuff to manage. We can get different types of products. I think we'd probably go with say this pro this middle one which is cheese and honey and tuna and powdered sugar and such. That's 750. Both of these are 750. Ideally, if we got the first one where you got your basic um like cleaning stuff and consumables and shampoos and toiletries and such. That that's more re well-rounded. Um that makes us going from this, like which is a lot of like baking and, you know, beverages and stuff like that too. Actually, you could probably do majority of your shop here. Hey, we finally sold one of the oils. You're doing great work there. Oh, and they even dump the empty box in there. <laughs> this is good. People are still shopping. Let's see what we've got in the basket so far. See, what is best to do, actually, I'm guessing is go to the next day, wait for the guy to restock everything, and then start reordering. Because, obviously, they're restocking this. I might say, oh, yeah, we need loads of pasta. But we might have loads of pasta in this storage. You just have to remember what you've got. We did have some. It was up there. So I definitely need to order some unit of pasta. And I'm going to say three order of pasta. Yeah, why not? Flour. Do we have flour in stock? This is, as I said, why it should be in order. We don't have that flour. So I'm going to order three of... Um, oh, yeah, three of those. So three of the red pasta. Uh, red flour, should I say. Definitely at least two, but I'm going to say three. Uh, peanut butters, because I want, in that storage, I want, let me say, this mirrored. Is it better to... We're not really utilising this as best we can, are we? Probably best to pick it up and move it round. Like that. And then like that. But then there's still... You, still... you can't fit anything else in, so doesn't really matter. No, it doesn't really matter, does it? Okay. Well, I think we're going to go for the next day. And uh, olive oil's gone down. Candy, salt and soda's gone up. So... Candy, I believe. That's okay. It's all right. Actually, I think I can check here and it tells you what's gone up and down. Olive oil's gone down. Salt, soda, and candy. 
salt. Mm. Soda. And candy we've already checked. Okay, good. So this guy's restocking. And let's get the orders in. So, pasta, flour, peanut butter, candy. Which is going to be, just going to get two of those. What are over here? Milk and cheese. Let's go for maybe two milks and two cheeses. I'm already maxed out anyway. And there we go. Oh, 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 I'll take the bottom box. <laughs> so what I'm going to do, I'm going to fill that up and then go for pasta. Oh, that's even worse because I have to go around now. Yeah, I'm changing that. Uh, let me just pick this up. Rotate it round, because that is horrible. Once we've got the expansion, we will be able to do something like that. So, it can go on there. Flour, and put there. Flour, not you can't double stack that. So, it is going to just be stored in that corner. Like that. Um, pasta. Peanut butter. Let me see this guy's going to crack on and do this anywhere. And I ordered these three to see if you can... Oh, you can triple stack it. I don't know if it goes on top of one another. But there's all of that. So he's going to do that. Um, milk. And... I think a yoghurt we could probably get. So we'll get two milks. We're going to get two yoghurts. Purchase that. And there's probably nowhere to store these at this stage. And I'm aware that every time we're doing this, I'm changing the order of stuff. So I'm going to have to get a proper system eventually. Yes. Okay. Well, we have managed to restock. I think we're going to leave it there for now. That's been a bit of Supermarket Simulator. Shelf stacking simulator, box opening simulator, whatever you want to call it. We have the option for, next time, either purchasing another license, which would be probably like cleaning products. That would round off the shop better than the cheese, but then also cheese. So, or increase storage. Increasing storage was how much? 700? 800. 800. 800 as opposed to 750 for the different products. Increasing storage would long term be better. Because this guy is obviously cracking on and stocking all of these shells for us. I'll have a think. Let me know what you think in the comments too. And uh, yeah, we'll leave it there. Next episode, we will go ahead and. Are you having problems there, matey? You alright? Um, I don't know if they're actually stocking that. I think they're stuck. <laughs> hmm. My employee has malfunctioned. <laughs> I might need to move this a little bit. And now I can't place it because they're in the way. <laughs> right. Try that. No. It appears that they can't restock yoghurt. And they're desperately trying to do so. Okay. Bit of a bug there. I don't know if that's him permanently broke or the reload will fix it. Either way, we'll leave it there for now. Next episode, we'll look at fixing an employee and um, continuing on. As always, hope you have enjoyed it. And comments in the comments. Thanks very much for watching. Take care and generic parlings.